kind of felt like our team just really came together last week. Uh, we talked before the game about, you know, not many people believe, but I said there's 40 people in this room that believe, and I truly think the kids felt that in their hearts and they went out and played that way. Make no mistake about it, Triopia slayed a considerable football dragon last week with great team effort from the players, and with yet another textbook masterstroke game plan from defensive coordinator Andy Phelps. Our kids are playing with high confidence level right now, especially on the defensive side of the ball. Um, Coach Phelps is tremendous in game planning, and he just seems to take all of our pieces of the puzzle and put them together the right way, and I thought he did an excellent job last week, and the kids bought into the system, and, and you know, this is going to be a totally different animal this week with more of a running attack and uh, uh, more power running, but, we'll, you know, we think we'll be ready for him. And the Trojan defenders really don't have any choice. Facing a football team that dropped a state playoff record 78 points last week, and that is averaging 69 points per game in the postseason. It's pretty amazing what they did last week. Uh, you know, they were playing a team that was passing a lot, so the clock was stopping, and they were scoring a lot as, as well. Um, Leroy is a quick strike offense. They have the speed to break it when they get loose. They kind of play real tight set, and when they get out of the pack, they, they have enough speed to take it to the end zone. So uh, that's something we're going to have to do well is really tackle well. Their fullback, I guess, single, he would probably be the – uh, you know, the best running back that we've seen on paper as far as yardage for the season and yards per carry and touchdowns. So we've got to do a, a good job of, of stopping him. We, we kind of pinpointed uh, CNM or Central's quarterback last week and we kind of contained him. And, and this week it's the Bruning boy, the fullback. We've got to contain him. And perhaps for the Trojans, the best avenue to do that is to not let him on the field. We've got to control the ball. We can't three and out a lot. We've got to be able to hold on to the ball even if we don't get points out of it. Their defense is better than people are giving them credit for. They, they play very fast. Uh, they remind me a lot about uh, of Camp Point where they're taking chances and trying to get in your backfield and disrupt things. But they do give up the big plays. So hopefully we can get some creases and, and make some big plays.